Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel Farmer Drone. I was at this beautiful cottage last year at this time to film the aftermath of the fire at Centennial Lake about two hours west of Ottawa. Centennial Lake was created in 1967 as part of a large hydro project. It's obvious the fire was extremely hot and very intense. In some areas it was burnt right from the treetops to the ground. So hop on board and let's fly out to the island and see how Mother Nature has started the repairs. If you've never been to Centennial Lake, I certainly suggest now is the time. It's a beautiful lake. I think you'll quickly agree which pictures are those from last year and those videos that I recorded this year. This is the location where it was suspected the fire originated. What an amazing amount of growth in just one year. This is the location where the fire jumped from the island back onto the mainland. And as you can see by the following video, there is such a dramatic change. Mother Nature is really doing her job here. Most of the needles from the evergreens have fallen to the ground and the dead tree becomes brittle. Gusts of winds and thunderstorms will easily drop these trees and as soon as they hit the ground, they quickly rot. I remember flying into this opening where it was, was such a dry location. And now look at it. If you look at this tree in these two different shots a year apart, you can see how the bark is falling off in the second shot as the tree begins to rot. These shots here, filmed one year apart, show such a positive dramatic change. Just look at this dramatic change in this location just one year apart. As devastating as forest fires can be, especially when it comes to human loss, infrastructure, or the loss of wildlife, forest fires are actually extremely good for the flora of the forest, and it's certainly evident in this video. It was nice to see all the new leaves in the undergrowth waving in the wind. In a few short years, there will be very little sign there was a fire here at all. And as hard as I tried, I could not spot Daphne the doe anywhere. I hope she's okay. I do not represent the owners of this beautiful home on Centennial Lake, but it is called Serenity Cove, and it's available for rent on Airbnb. 
check it out. Thanks for watching and subscribe to watch all of my videos on my channel.